A local chef honors the men and women who serve our community by cooking up gourmet meals. John Capadonna quit his job so he could spend quality time at local firehouses. News 13's Adriana Mendez joins us. And Adriana, why did he decide to leave his job for this? Well, John has always had a love for firefighters, and after a family member who was also a firefighter passed away, he realized time is precious, and he'd rather work for free doing something he loves. All right. I use the Maui onions. Food is best served. You can't find them anymore. When it's made from the heart. With those there, we should have 32. John Capadonna has been a chef for decades. Raisins are part of the traditional recipe. And says cooking is his way of spreading love. Totally, yeah. He recently cut ties with his last job so he could do this. Two, but you might have to break a couple up. Now making full course dinners for a group of special guests. And uh, I just wanted to be able to do something uh, to benefit the community and also give back. We both have the same kind of feelings towards cooking food that helps people and people who deserve it. The table is set for a gourmet meal, but not in a place that you would expect. A project that I started called Chef and the Firehouses. In the middle of the Tryon Firehouse, firefighters enjoyed pork medallions and vegetables. Here, dear. We always eat good, but uh, to this level, it was uh, it was something else. John started his Chef in the Firehouse program about a month ago. My love of cooking, I like to pass it on. And he is now making it his mission to bring tasty dinners to local firefighters in Polk County. They don't have a chance to go out a lot of times. How's everything down? Quiet. John says beating prostate cancer helped him see what his true passion is. That's part of the reason why I wanted to do it now. You can't wait till later with something because you never know. And he looks at this project as a way to pay back those who serve our community. I did have one guy come up to me, an older gentleman, and say, this is the best meal I had in years. Seeing the smiling faces and full stomachs is worth more to John than any monetary value. So obviously they enjoyed it, and uh, I know I did. Are you full? I'm full, yeah, and that's hard to do. And he says this moment is payment enough. Hope somebody will be able to cook for him like that uh, in the future. John is also handing out plaques to a deserving firefighter at each location. He does this solely with the help of sponsorship and a GoFundMe account. His next step is the firehouse in Landrum. Back to you.